Most men avoid therapy because most therapy approaches are not designed to help the male brain deal with pain or find solutions. That makes men believe therapy is worthless and men skip things that feel worthless. Also, male depression is usually based on feeling helpless, powerless, and unable to affect one's life or environment. Therapy models focus on helping men feel heard and loved instead of restoring their sense of personal power. Men need solutions, not just feelings. So much of mental health in America is based on the medical model and endless triage, endless triage management, symptom management. That's all it is for the rest of their life. And when you get a man into that system, men would rather kill themselves than sit there and say, I am disabled. I must have a medical help, a medical assistance for the rest of my life. And all I can do is sit here and talk about my feelings endlessly for the next 10 years while paying $10,000 for the privilege. 